guys welcome back to my channel so today i want to tell you guys all about my current favorite i feel like i haven't filmed something like this in a very long time and the reason why i'm filming like a sit down video is because i'm currently not vlogging so i thought instead of like not like uh posting videos i can just um tell you guys about my current favorite and i feel like it's much better than no video at all and i hope you guys will understand i'm currently going through something personal so i cannot vlog so i wanted to come here and tell you guys about my current favorite there's something in my eye and i don't like i can't i can't get rid of it because um i don't want to mess up my makeup but i'll try to to just ignore it i always want to put up vlogs that i'm 100 happy with and vlogs that um so like basically i don't want to film myself unhappy so so i thought instead of not um filming anything or instead of not posting vlogs because i haven't posted i think in a while so i i wanted to film something for you guys and yeah i hope you guys will enjoy it and yeah so today i'm gonna be sharing with you guys my current favorite i love filming these videos and i love watching them i have um separated them into like three three groups so i have beauty i have lifestyle and then i have fashion so i'm not sure if i'm gonna be able to tell you guys everything one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen I want to make it like 10 items that I'm currently loving. I'm not sure which three I'm going to remove from this list. Anyway, the first thing I want to share with you guys that I'm currently loving, you guys know, I have quite a few foundations that I I, 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 I use, but I, I'm i not like a huge like makeup collector anymore. I used to buy a lot of makeup when I was still at, um, on campus. I used to buy makeup like I was obsessed with makeup. And now I just feel like I buy things that I love and things that I feel like I need or things that I want to try out. I love buying foundation more than anything. I don't like buy eyeshadow palettes. I don't buy like I don't buy a lot of things like especially things that I don't use like I don't do like eye makeup so I never buy eyeshadow palettes I never buy what else I don't buy a lot of things I just focus on like uh, the base so I love trying out new foundations and the one that I recently got is the Dior Backstage Foundation absolutely love it you guys have seen me use this um, use this one uh, in a vlog and I struggled to get my shade but I finally got it uh, I did show you guys but yeah this is the Dio the Dio backstage foundation love 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 it's honestly one of my favorite foundations I have the before I got this one I think I got the Chanel I don't remember the name of the foundation but I got that Chanel foundation I did I also did show you guys that one but I don't know I just didn't love it I liked it but I just didn't love it. I wasn't happy with how it was like it wasn't it wasn't giving me that finish that I was going for. I love foundations that look dewy and that look like skin. I don't want to feel cakey. It's not cakey, but I also don't want a foundation that looks like moisturizer. It just wasn't giving what I like what I was expecting. So I realized that I wasn't using it as much. I still use it like once in a while and I recently got this one. I've been watching a lot, like I always watch a lot of reviews. So I saw that K I'm not sure if it was K or Cynthia, but they're using this foundation and I knew I had to get it. Like I loved how it looked like on their skin. And yeah, it's just a beautiful foundation. I really, really love it. I wouldn't say it's full color. Coverage. maybe maybe i can say it's medium coverage but yeah i really really love it and while we're still talking about foundation i would also love to thank online makeup academy for sponsoring this video so basically online makeup academy is an online makeup school what i love about them is that you get a certificate i think it's called the omaka certificate at the end of the course so it's basically for people who want to improve their makeup skills or someone who wants to be a professional makeup uh, makeup artist so if any of you guys is interested i want to leave all the details in the description 
description box i think they also gave me a coupon code so yeah i'm gonna leave everything in the description box if you guys are interested please make sure to check that out especially if you want to be a makeup artist like a professional makeup artist and you want to work with people they have really really amazing classes i am enrolled in one of the courses i think i've completed the first module of the course and you enroll just like um, a normal class you watch the videos and tutorials which are facilitated by your instructor so another thing i love about online makeup academy is that their classes are recorded which is amazing because you can get to watch like and re-watch like any class as many times as you like welcome to the online makeup academy my name is mariana and i will be your instructor i am so excited to have you here today and that you have made a decision to change your life we have worked really hard developing this course for you we try to combine both of best worlds the online education experience and the physical school we have had a school in new york city for many years and we have worked with all kinds of students and it was always amazing but we've decided with this whole situation that the world is taking us to do an online version of what we have learned in real life and guess what we have this amazing program developed for you so you can also download the pdfs or go back to the videos and watch them even after you've completed your course which i think is really nice you do receive feedback uh, and guidance every step of the way as you would like in a physical school so they do give you like tutorials homework which you can submit for example let's say maybe you are learning about brows like how to do your brows and then maybe they will give you like um homework to do your brows and then you have to record yourself doing your brows or i think maybe you can do even someone else's brows and then you submit that video to them and then they can give you feedback based on how you performed or based on how you did those brows i think it's really great um, that they have incorporated that because i feel like if you are learning you're just watching all these videos and not like getting feedback or having someone who can tell you if you like who can tell if you've mastered the um, what is it if you've mastered the technique or not i think it's really great because i don't think i would enjoy learning if there was no one to tell me if i really really understand like the um, what is being taught so yeah it is very convenient and it's quite affordable and I, as i told you guys they did give me a coupon code i think so i'm gonna try to leave everything in the description box it's a really really great like learning platform and i also did a quiz which i passed <laughs> i'll show you guys the evidence i did a quiz which i passed i think it's a really great platform for people who want to improve their makeup application skills uh, especially people who want to like be professional makeup artists um, and have a certificate which you get at the end of the um, like after completing the course and submitting all the assignments and homeworks I'm gonna leave all their details in the description box if you guys are interested please make sure to check them out I also have another foundation which I cannot like not mention i need to mention this foundation because i love it i think this is my second one i finished the first one and i got the second one this is a foundation that i've told you guys so many times about um it's the bobby brown skin what is it is it the skin for no what is it the stick foundation not the skin foundation the bobby brown stick foundation absolutely love it i love like like how easy it is to apply this it looks like it's just a stick i just love how it applies on your skin i just love how creamy and how it looks like like on my skin when i apply it it's so beautiful the packaging is minimal it's quite affordable uh, i think they have it on superfluous so i think it's cheaper on superfluous because they always have those discount codes so you can just get it from superfluous but you can also just go to bobby brown and get it from them uh, i think they have a bobby brown stand at edgar's so yeah really really love this foundation it's like i think this one is my like my favorite foundation and then this one is the second favorite yeah really really love this one so much i think in one of the vlogs i i tried the theology face mask um they sent me quite a few and i really really love the one the matcha one i think i used the matcha one i loved it so much i i even told you guys in that vlog that 
I am definitely gonna have to buy more of these because I really really love them this is I'm just gonna show you guys the, um, this one but it's not that one that I tried but this is the name of the brand it's called theology really really love it I think you can get these masks from superbalist I think they are basically like um, an organic skincare brand I'm not sure what else they have but I really really love their masks that matcha one was my favorite I'm not sure if I'm gonna love all like all of them but that matcha one was my favorite I love that they cover your entire face they go like around your ear and even your neck like they're just amazing I really really love these masks so much if you haven't tried them I would highly suggest trying out uh, trying the matcha one first because that's the one that I, I showed you guys the one that I tried with you guys and I really really loved it so yeah highly highly recommend them I really really love both masks and then the other product that I thought I should mention, like I have to mention this product because it saved my life. Like I'm not even exaggerating. I used to be so insecure with my skin. I had dark marks. My skin wasn't like super bad, but I had dark marks and I was breaking out and it was just annoying me because I never really had, I've never had like serious skin like issues i was using like sunscreen before but i wasn't consistent like it was just something that i used like once in a while when i remember to use it but now it's something that i use every day i use sunscreen every day i realized that when i started using sunscreen every day my dark marks started fading this is the sunscreen i'm currently using you guys know this one from eucerin absolutely love it the only thing i don't like about this sunscreen i told you guys before is that it's it burns my eyes so yeah that's the only thing i don't like but you can apply it as much as you like it won't like it doesn't leave like that gray cast or whatever it's called i love this sunscreen so much i swear by this sunscreen i really really love it i'm yet to find a sunscreen that doesn't burn my eyes but i um, i just try to apply it like like to not go um near my eyes when i apply it and yeah i think i got this one two months ago it's basically this bronzer this bronzer from chanel absolutely love it i've always wanted to get a cream bronzer and this is the one i don't use it every day because like, i want to finish it because it was quite expensive um yeah it's this chanel bronzer you guys can see that like every time i use it i don't have to apply too much because it's very what's the word it's very pigmented so i don't really have to apply too much i did use it today i'm not sure if you guys can tell this bronzer it's almost the same as my bobby brown my bobby brown uh foundation stick like the way it applies on your skin ugh, it feels so amazing i really really love it um the shade that i have i think it's the um, what shade is this i think this is their darkest shade it's called tan deep bronze absolutely love this um this bronzer the reason why i went for i decided to get a cream bronzer is because i have very like dry skin so i do have powder bronzer but i just don't like how like my skin feels so i don't know how to explain it like it feels so tight and i don't like applying powder on my face because i have super dry skin you can obviously get cheaper alternatives but this is the one i tried and i really 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 love it i love it so much i think you can get it at edgar's they have a chanel stand there and you can also get it at they have like a chanel store in center and you can get it there and the last thing i wanted to show you guys from my beauty slash skincare section are these cotton pads from woolies absolutely love them i have shown you guys this before i think they changed the packaging <laughs> so when i went there to buy them i was so confused because i was looking for the packaging that i know so what i love about these cotton pads i think i told you guys about these before i used to use the ones from dove and i didn't like i ended up not liking them because they leave like white stuff on your face so i started using these ones these ones from woolies I really really love these they don't leave white stuff on your face when you like when you are using them which i really love that was my main issue with those ones from um from dove but someone told me that dove also has like um these ones so i don't know i've never seen them i've looked everywhere 
I'm gonna talk about lifestyle slash home stuff that I'm currently loving and I have one two three four five I'm not sure if I'm gonna mention everything I'm just gonna mention the ones that I really really feel like you guys should know about um, so first thing I have is my bedding guys I recently got bedding <laughs> I recently got a new bedding to bedding set from Zara home you guys know like it's this one and the other one in the main bedroom I'm obsessed guys I used to buy white bedding all the time I still love white bedding don't get me wrong I still love it but I feel like it does get a bit boring to be honest it does get boring to use white bedding all the time and I am still gonna use white bedding because I, I love white bedding it just looks neat and yeah but I feel like this bedding that I have now ugh. like every time I come into this bedroom guys you just it I'm just always so happy it lifts my mood and it just makes me happy I know Zara home is quite expensive like I'm not gonna sit here and tell you that they are affordable because they are not even this one I got it on sale but it wasn't like cheap I feel like I should also mention this it's very important to like invest in your bedroom um, not just in your bedroom but in like your home if you like want to buy something and you feel like it's very expensive um, if you can I would say like save money at the end you buy something that you really love and something that will last you for a very long time because if you buy like cheap bedding let's say you buy like cheap bedding for 100 rands yes it's gonna be like it's gonna do its job but you will notice that it won't last you as long as like your expensive one and i don't think it has to be expensive for it to be good quality i think stores like at home zara home h&m home they have really amazing like bedding even continental linen they have really amazing like quality i feel like when it comes to your home like uh especially things that you use every day like your bedding you sleep on your bed every day so obviously you want to get like good quality i think when we like first moved our bedding wasn't great like even before we had cats our bedding was so bad i wouldn't say it's the cat but it had like what is this thing called it has like those cotton balls those like little cotton balls it's very important to invest in your home if like it's something that you obviously use every day you need to make sure that it's good quality i feel like h&m home they have almost the same style when it comes to bedding as zara home their bedding is really beautiful uh, and they have amazing quality as well another thing that i'm currently loving you guys know i recently got like new office furniture I'm obsessed with my office chair guys it's so comfortable I really really love it I got it from at home and it's the shepherd chair you guys know how much like I feel like there was was it last year or was it 2019 yeah 2019 that's when I discovered like this um, the shepherd material I fell in love with it from like I fell in love with it since 2019 and I still love shepherd so much it's honestly a fabric that I think is never gonna go out of style i think it's called adele adele something i'll leave a picture here you guys will see it's so beautiful i think it's one of my favorite furniture pieces that i recently got so yeah i really really love it this one is very important guys if you live in like um a big like big house this apartment is quite big it's a three bedroom apartment so it's quite big we've had a problem with our wi-fi um it connects in the um, master bedroom the living area obviously and the kitchen the dining area so the strength of the wi-fi is very weak in the, um, the other bedrooms so we've had that problem from i think last year last year we were in a two bedroom and the wi-fi connection was really bad in the office so i had to move from the office to work in the dining area because i couldn't work when like my connection was bad um so we recently got this i'll show you the box not the actual item but we recently got this thing it's called the wi-fi extender wi-fi range extender guys this has changed my life i'm not exaggerating i know i say this a lot but this has changed my life like i can now work from the office my wi-fi works everywhere now i can work from any room that i want to work from the connection is amazing so this is called the wi-fi range extender i 
think we got this one from HyphaCorp. They have it at Macro. They have it at Incredible Connections, I think. You can also order this from Take A Lot. I think we have clear access in this complex. Uh, so we sent them an email because I was just annoyed. I was getting frustrated. We decided to send them an email and ask if we, if they can do something or if they can extend the range or whatever so they sent us a quotation i think it was around 3.9 we didn't ask anyone to install this for us it's very easy guys so we got this for i think it was for 500 rand the setup was so easy and what i love about this you don't have to like to pay every month it's just a one-off payment you just pay for the device and then you plug it um it has all the steps here it's very easy it doesn't even take like five minutes to set this up and they're gonna charge us like three thousand and something like to install this thing which is so easy so we got this from hyper Corp, i think or incredible connections i don't remember it looks like that little mosquito thing that you plug in it looks like that it just stays on and it hasn't given us any issues we still love it and it works perfectly fine so yeah so basically how it works it connects with your wi-fi and it just spreads the coverage i don't know how to explain it in technical terms but yeah it just extends the coverage so you just pay for the device and it's a once-off payment so yeah i'm really happy with this it's something that i feel like a lot of people need i'm not sure if i'm just the only one who didn't know about this but yeah if you guys didn't know you can just get yourself this little device so i'm gonna quickly move on to fashion now i think i have four items left that i'm gonna show you and then we'll We'll wrap up this video i've been using this every day like every day like literally every day every time when i leave the house you guys see this item so yeah it is this bag this bag from mango i'm in love with it really really love it you guys have seen this bag so many times i use this bag every day i'm sure you guys are tired of me at this point but i'm obsessed with this bag i love how minimal and just how simple it is not small it's not big it's just like the right size i love this bag so much you can carry it like this but i normally carry i normally carry it like this i really really love like the color the pleats it's so beautiful i think they still have it i'll try to find it um and insert the picture here so that you guys will know like what to search for if you're looking for like if you want to get it but yeah this is the first item i feel like i had to mention this as the first item because i'm obsessed with this bag and you guys know like i have quite a lot of bags but this one i think i've been using like i've been using it more than like all the bags that i have another thing i love are these shorts these Bermuda shorts, let me just stand here. Guys, absolutely love them. I love them so much. These are from H&M. I have two of these. These are the black ones. I also have the white ones, which I've worn. And this is how they look like. Another item that I have are these shorts. These shorts, I'm gonna try them on for you guys to show you how they fit. Ah, oh, these are so stunning. I'm sure you guys can tell that I'm obsessed with like Bermuda shorts. These are also Bermuda shorts, but these ones are from these ones are from Misguided. I think I got these from take not take a lot. I got these from Superbalist and ah oh, love them so much. Let me just quickly try them on for you guys so that you can see how they look. I love them. I love how like they fit on my waist and my thighs. Oh, these are so stunning. I'm obsessed with these. And the last thing I wanted to share with you guys, it's something that I got, I think I got this like three weeks or a month ago. It's these earrings, these earrings. I also have this one, this one. They came as a set from Mango. So I'm only wearing this one today because if I wear this one, 
I have to remove all these earrings and I can't because this one hasn't healed so this one is still healing so I can't touch this one so I decided to only wear this cuff earring I'm not sure you guys can see but I did show you in one of the vlogs this one is so beautiful I love that it's not just like gold but it has this little this detail here at the bottom it's like um I think it's like a very a very light pink i really really love like the combination of gold and this light pink it's so beautiful so yeah that's the earring i wanted to show you guys i think i've covered everything if i forgot something then i'm gonna have to show you guys in a vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it i'll be back soon with the vlogs if you did enjoy this video please make sure to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and i'll see you guys on the next one bye guys